That's right, and hopefully more, Kareen and Rick. This toxin in the ocean is killing or sickening thousands of marine mammals. The Marine Mammal Care Center here in San Pedro, right behind me, is the only rehabilitation center in Los Angeles County for these types of animals. Right now it is filled to capacity and the situation could be getting worse. Those eyes, those faces, sea lions and elephant seals pack the Marine Mammal Care Center in San Pedro. Some are healthy and will soon be ready for life on their own in the wild. Others are not, and they require special care, medication, and treatment. Experts say these marine mammals, mostly sea lions, are part of a wildlife crisis along the California coastline. We're seeing in a really large algal bloom off the coast of California, specifically central Southern California. It is a, a toxic algal bloom that uh, causes demoic acid poisoning in our sea lion and dolphin populations especially. Demoic acid poisoning. Sick animals washing up on shore can be prone to seizures, aggression, vomiting, and foaming at the mouth. Nursing mothers can lose their milk. Ultimately, the condition can be fatal. Care centers up and down the Golden State are doing everything they can to save these incredible creatures, but the facilities have limited resources and space. Many are filled to capacity, including the Marine Mammal Care Center. So it is a naturally occurring uh, uh, algae in the environment. It is uh, becoming more intense and larger in scope because of warmer ocean temperatures. We have the hottest uh, temperature on record for the, for the ocean at the moment. Um, that's a contributing factor which is caused by human impacts. Experts say the problem is compounded with timing. This is birthing season for sea lions. Also, Fourth of July celebrations are fast approaching. That means more people on the beaches and the loud blasting of fireworks, which can trigger more seizures and behavioral problems with the sick marine mammals. If sick animals are treated early enough, the good news is there's a very high success rate for rehabilitation and recovery. If you do encounter one of these marine mammals on the beach, do not get too close. Sick or not, they can be very aggressive. They can bite. Just stay back and contact the proper authorities or organizations. Reporting live in San Pedro, Chris Wolf, KTLA 5 News. Okay, Wolfie, thank you.